Welcome back guys. Our next beer is going to be the Skinny Dip by a, a new Belgium brewery. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's a 4.2% alcohol. Right. So it's pretty light actually. Yeah, it's yeah. a little bit. Is, is it officially the lightest we've had so far? I think, think so. so, yeah. Okay, cool. um, it's called Skinny Dip. Though. But, you know, unlike the, the Fat Tire one, this one they actually did tell us what hops they have in it. Yeah, just a little, very, very... Very, very just, just a hint to give us a... But it's uh, made from Cascade Hops, our old friends. Right. Uh, Cascades. Alright guys, so I mean... Oh, whoa, whoa. and I forgot to mention, it has a ca kaffir lime leaf. Kaffir lime leaf, yeah. Which to give us supposed citrus taste. A citrus taste, which we'll, we'll look into in a, in a couple. So Sweet. we'll see. Alright, so let's just uh, get right in. So, the pour on this particular beer will be pretty much as or like the uh, fat tire one. Um, straight down, actually not straight down, uh, slant it down up until pretty much the uh, half portion of the of, of the pilsner glass, like so. which we're using. And then after you get to that des designated spot, straight down to get some of that wonderful head. And look at RG. Wow, good job, RG. RG got the best head the same. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. But you guys, you guys is, uh, has more bubbly, mine's more of a straight out foam. Cool. That's cool. Good, That's good. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh, the color, guys. The color. Oh, yeah. It's video. You can see it. Alright, color. Alan. <laughs> Why does your voice change every time you talk to me? You, ang you anger me. Alan. <laughs> Description. It's a very, uh, uh, it's a very light color. Um, Slightly dark yellow. I'm gonna go with that one. <laughs> dark yellow. <laughs> I would say more so like a, a very light amber. If if that. And mm -hmm. that's pretty much it, really. Yeah, you're, it's like, it looks like a basic, looks like a light beer, almost kind of like the light yellow. I mean, I'm gonna go with apple juice. I don't know. Like, I drink a lot of apple juice, but yeah, it's just go light it yellow, light, light coppers. Alright, cool. <laughs> Aromas. Ignore me, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I get that uh, slight. Uh, I can't say it. The, the, the smells are so light. Just you smell the alcohol a lot more. <laughs> Jonah said what? And yeah, I don't know. Ideally, probably describe it better than so I can. I don't know. Diego, what's your <laughs> <laughs> what's your description of this? It smell, dude. Um, off the bat, this is already we'll be reviewing too many casket hops in the, in the past couple of reviews mm -hmm. of beers. I can easily. Smell that uh, the hoppiness to it, the lightness. Huh? You take a drink? No. <laughs> oh, yeah, there you go. So the casket hops pop out. They're becoming your buddies now. Exactly, our buddies, and most notably, it does have that nice uh, citrus smell to it. It's not pungent, as you would think, but it is there. It's more noticeable than on, on the uh, on the previous beer, which was the fat tire. That's that's yeah. my take on it. So no no maltiness, just well, it's just from the smell. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a clean smell. Yeah, I agree. agree. What about you? Light, light, light everything, man. Uh, <laughs> light everything. Yeah, light a little bit. I don't know. I don't, maybe it's more of a beer. Just taste it. Yeah, let's go, dude. All right, guys, let's take a Cheers. drink and let's see where this takes us. Good luck, guys. All right. Give it a second. Let those taste buds register. Diego. Hmm. Um, first thing you light everything as we as we discussed so far. Light on the palate. It's um, first thing is light hoppiness in the beginning, and then um, the the body itself is extremely light. Carbonation is it's, it's up there. Yeah. It's up there in the carbonation. Um, other than that, it just delivers um, light peak on the hoppiness, and then just fades away. It's great for the summertime. I mean, that's why it's, it's a summer seasonal. It's just a light overall light beer. Right. All right. Well, I'm gonna start with the positives. Um, so yeah, it's refreshing. It. It's, it's uh, cold. It's cold. But for me, the okay, the alcohol content is low. Mm -hmm. So it isn't always bad, but yeah. um, the hoppy taste is there, but it's very in the background, which is bad because the other flavors in there are very light to begin with. Yeah. yeah. So it's not my beer okay. for me. Well, guys, uh, with this beer, it's a, it lives up to its name. It's like a, it's a pretty much skinny. It's like it's light. It's it's you know 
Good know, job. Not much there. Just more like that. you are quite the. It's for the people not really into much into beer. You just want something light, maybe to have on a summer day with a meal, something like that. I think that's the kind of beer it is. But for more experienced drinkers, maybe not so much, just because it's so light, and it's not too much. Well, I think you just answered the next question, right? What would you drink it? Yeah. yeah. So I guess that answered mine, right? Okay. Right. So Alan, where would you see yourself drinking his beverage? If I did drink it willingly, um, <laughs> willingly, <laughs> willingly, yes. Uh, honestly, it's. I don't think I would eat anything with it or whatever, so I think it's just a beer stand alone. Cause yeah. it's so it's so light, the flavors aren't really strong, so just probably watching the game or something, drinking this. I there agree with Alan on this one, dude, completely. Probably watching, uh, probably buy a, a six pack or a twelve pack, take it home, watch a, a game, catch a, a light game, something, and then really just sit sit down and just drink it and just enjoy the beer itself. But I mean, uh, it's not necessarily my my preference in beers. You know, as you guys already know, I'm pretty yeah. big on IPAs and anything that's pretty yeah. old or stouts and yeah. or ales of that nature. So. I mean, a light beer, it's a summer ale, so I mean, I'm sorry, it's, uh, a blonde ale. Blonde ale, American so it's a, blonde ale. So it's, 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 it's a summertime beer, so you I mean, expectations are going to be obviously a light beer, something refreshing that you need in the summertime, yeah. you don't need too much alcohol. So yeah. that's what I agree with, you know? What about you? Yeah, pretty much the beers, if you're more of experienced, like the heavier stuff, you might not like this because it's so light, it's so the opposite of all that. Yeah. But overall, it's a good light beer if you're going to be hanging out, you know, relaxing kind of beer. All right, all right so, so we're good. Anything else we like no, to add? I'm no, I'm good. Final notes, I'm good. All right, so this is a. Uh, the new Belgian brewery, the Skinny Skinny Dip, Skinny Dip American Blonde Ale. Um, you know, if you like light beers, pick it up. Maybe it'll be your thing. All right, guys. Hopefully, you enjoy. Till next time.